So hello guys again, welcome to Explore 254. It has been quite a very very long time since we did a video for you guys. And this time we want to take you back to the story that we used to bring you almost every weekend. And that is the story of the BRT or the Bus Rapid Transit that was being developed along the Vika Superhighway. Of late you would realize also from the city bloggers that they have gone silent on the topic of the BRT. And because the topic, uh, because the project is, itself has got silent on bloggers, so what I want to do today is to walk you around one of the stations that uh, had were step ahead in terms of construction development, but today they have stalled. Actually, if you check a video we did six months ago, there is no difference with the status of this project today. So the question we are asking ourselves, as, as you guys will see. Uh, do you think this project has stalled or do you think it has been uh, judged uh, non-viable? So go up, go around with me guys and tell me all your thoughts. So I will show you more about this and it is not only the, the bus station that I will show you but I will also take you to the depot at the Kasarani Stadium. So come with me guys and you will learn more. The bus rapid transit was intended to be complete by April 2022. The intention of the bus rapid transit, as many of you know, it is a global concept and it is intended to create a dedicated lane along the Vika Superhighway so that buses could use this lane without interference from other motor cyclists okay? and other motorists. So, people with private cars were expected to leave their cars at home and use these dedicated lanes. But the question has been, will this project really meet its deadline? Actually, from our own observation, contractors left this site more than six months ago. And let me show you something interesting from one of the sites that we collected near Gedurai. In this site, you will see grass growing. Grass is growing and there has been no work going on for a very long time. So our question is not to tell you guys whether this project will be completed within the intended timeline and the causes for the delay are actually not known, but we suspect that the full operationalization of this project is a huge hindrance because there were so many stakeholders who needed to be consulted including the association of public transport operators among others so the delay is quite visible it is quite real and what we gonna do guys is go up the footprint and see whether they are something that has changed so this is the tunnel of the safari park and you see those shades that we are intended to be the booking station and the waiting bay i did a video over six months ago and it was just the way it is today and as we i zoom a little bit for you to see nothing tangible has happened Actually, most motorists have cried for that the barricades that are put along this road have caused a lot of accidents. You see, nothing really has changed that much. And we proceed along this tunnel, guys, and see whether something else has changed. And you see, nothing much. Let us get in now. that it was a, a, a mixed 
project because uh, I doubt it was in the mind of the constructors of the Vika Super Highway. So what I'm going to show you as we proceed now is the place where grass has grown. This is the Gedurai BRT station. Just see for yourself. In between the two guard rails where the BRT station is supposed to be located. You see that grass? The grass is growing there, guys. It is unbelievable. That should be a busy tunnel being used by people, all contractors, or even other going their day to day activities. But you see the grass of that tunnel, which tells you nothing much has been happening. 